In, uh, in recent hours, the Garda uh, Commissioner is on the record as saying that proposed legislation to, oversaw, uh, to overhaul oversight of the Garda force would lead to him spending more time reporting to oversight bodies uh, than overseeing policing and leadership of the service. Uh, that the Policing Security and Community Safety Bill 2021, as it currently stood, would lead to dysfunctional uh, micromanagement, and that the bill would grant powers to the proposed new Garda Ombudsman, which he said would be disproportionate and unconstitutional, and wouldn't withstand an expensive and time-consuming test in the courts. Does the Minister agree uh, that it is an unhealthy sign uh, in our democracy that a Garda Commissioner feels compelled uh, and possibly unheard by government and compelled to address an Oireachtas uh, committee uh, to this extent. And is the government listening uh, to the Garda Commissioner's uh, concerns? Thank Thanks, you, Deputy. I'd always listen to the Garda Commissioner. My understanding the piece of legislation you, you uh, are concerned about is in PLS, in, in pre-legislative scrutiny, and, and I think that's probably the best place for all of us. Members of the government are on the, are on the committees as well as, on, as with the opposition, and that I think the role of the, the committees and in pre-legislative scrutiny uh, is to provide an opportunity to listen to the Guard Commissioner. That's the system working, in my mind, appropriately. Uh, and, uh, and so I, I would listen to his words with real care and, and listen to the questioning from the government representatives on the committee as government representatives, in effect. Gracias.